I'm doing pop culture, entertainment, that first heard, things like that. You might know Amber's got a friend named Eve Barlow. Now, Eve claims that she's a journalist. And some other things. Well, actually, Eve has claimed she's a legendary journalist. If you mean by legendary, getting kicked out of a court case which billions of people are watching, well, I guess kind of a legend, but not quite in the way you might want to be. So she says on here, who the F-U-C-K wrote me a Wikipedia page? I'm not a blogger. Well, actually, she kind of is. She writes her Substack and she writes all these articles and things like that. So in a way, she's a blogger, but I understand the frustration. She doesn't want to be known as a blogger. So this person here says, laughing my effing ass off. Okay, who the F did it? Oh my God, go read it. Hilarious with speculation on who wrote it. It wasn't me. Some people actually thought it might be me, but no, I wouldn't write one paragraph on Eve. And why would I write a Wikipedia page on her? I honestly don't even know how to edit it. It's probably not that hard. But no, not my style. So this is pretty much the whole thing right here. Eve Barlow as the title. Eve Barlow was a Scottish-American music journalist and blogger based in Los Angeles. Raised in Gloucester, she was formerly deputy editor of the NME. Barlow is also a Jewish activist who advocates for Israel. They have her date of birth. I guess it's right. I'm not sure. Not super important. Looks about right. They have her university there. And under occupation, it says blogger and Amber Heard's assistant. Well, I'm sure that she's not actually technically Amber's assistant, but she does assist Amber quite a bit on Twitter and as far as pushing the narrative that Amber can't be wrong. And Johnny actually pulled this whole legal stunt. The court of Virginia, the U.S. official court, made a ton of mistakes that nobody caught. Well, not nobody. Even her friends caught all those mistakes. As a request of Johnny Depp's legal team, Barlow was excluded from the Depp vs. Heard trial, and what they mean is literally excluded and kicked out physically. Why? Well, live tweeting during the trial. It was one of the biggest trials in celebrity history. Could that be for clout and attention, and possibly certain monetization because she does have a donation button on Twitter. Just some personal speculation. And here you can see who actually edited the thing, which is not eHacker. Got some of the usual laugh out louds. I don't like to laugh at this kind of thing. You know, if it's wrong information, okay, take it down and everything. But if people want to laugh, well, that's what we call freedom of speech. This person says she's more upset at being called a blogger than lying to a judge and getting thrown out and barred from court. Wow, people of strange values. All right, so yeah, she complained about being a blogger, but not about someone putting up the info that she was kicked out of court. Which is true, though. I mean, you know, she can't argue about that. And this person, We Evil Barlow Parody Account, says, I'm so outraged that there's been an entry in Wikipedia about me that I'm going to tweet about it so that people are aware that I'm so important that someone's made a Wikipedia article about me. Glad I paid them to include stuff I object to so it doesn't look like I arranged it. And this person, by the way, has an Eve Barlow parody account. And this person here says, not you, was it, John? And I say, nope, it's only a paragraph. Mine would have been longer. And if I wrote it, it would have been longer. But it is entertaining. It is interesting. Anyway... Not so many fine details on this one. Let me know what you think down below. Doing pop culture, entertainment, stuff like that. Consider subscribing here. If you don't, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.